Recharged, our hunters split up for the evening stalk as Brad teams with guide Johan to tempt fate as they track the volatile, deadly western savanna buffalo. All right, well, the buffalo dance starts again. The guys are out looking on the road. We just found a buffalo track and uh, trying to make a decision whether we should go after him or not. I'd like to have Steve with me on buffalo hunting, especially for a good backup, but it only made sense because he's going after New Zealand. So we decided to split, and um, I wanted to get after my buffalo. Okay, let's go down. It's a good one. Good one? Get your gun. We go down. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. You, as the shooter, you absolutely have to keep everybody in your hunting party in mind. I've heard about it. You hear about the buffalo incidents a year. People were killed. The people were maimed. One encounter you don't want is you don't want a buffalo on top of you. For the moment, they're, they're quiet. So we're going to wait till they stop there's, there's one that's in the, the body is big on the left. Black one. Which one? The dark one on the left. On the left. Yeah, on the far the left. left. The black one. As we were approaching, we saw then another one and another one, and in fact, that, that was a, a big herd, maybe, may, maybe 15, 20 buffaloes. So we had to be more careful because uh, more buffaloes, is, more eyes watching at us and hearing things, so it's quite different from approaching uh, one buffalo. The white cow's looking right at us. She's looking right at us. The one over here, she's looking right at us. I think. If there's a good one, it's the big one on the left. I, I can't see his head. We had seen a lot of buffalo with Brad before, and every time there was no bull, no, no shootable bull. So uh, we still didn't know at that time if, if it was going to be different that day. Uh, we, had to, we had to go uh, go a bit nearer them and, and, uh, and be very careful so not to lose this occasion. Yeah, there's two of them. Gotcha. Look at the red one. Red one on the left. Wait, wait, wait. I need to see them. There he is. He's coming. I got it. Wait, wait. We check because mate, the red one seems to be a very nice one also. So, What do you think? Well, the red one seems a young one, but I still yeah. haven't seen the, the trophy. So, And the black one seems... He's well, the body unique. is much bigger. The body is much bigger, so I suppose it's an old one. Yeah. Let me check. See, this one you were talking about, so you're right into the trees. He, 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 the one I got is shoots way behind. They're all milling and crossing, and you got cows and calves, and you got bulls behind. You really have to wait, and you hope that the wind is in your favor. Uh, we decided to just kind of jockey a little bit for position. OK, we have to be. OK, let's go. Come here. Come on. Got it. Ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. At that point, you have a, a, a whole different level of seriousness when you're shooting dangerous game because you make a mistake and you could cost somebody else their life as well as yours. Okay, you see the black one? Got it. You got, got it, it well? Yep. Yeah. Okay, shoot then. Okay, here we go. Yeah, good shoot. Reload. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. What do you think? Wait a second. Wait. He's down. He's down. I saw, uh, as usual, the the bullet go uh, the perfect place, and and that was uh, that was going to be uh, a good uh, good moment again. This federal premium ammo with a Barnes triple shock, it's devastating, yeah. and that was uh, 165 yards. Oh, let's walk up and look at him. I can't wait, man. I cannot wait to get my hands on him. You know, as we walked up to my buffalo, I mean, it's unbelievable. You just see claw marks all over from the lions. Look at all these lion scratches here and here and here, you know, and there. They've been all over this bull trying to take him down, and he survived it. Yeah, that's... He's a survivor. That's how you see it. Uh, you can tell it's an old one because uh, he's been taken quite a few times by the lion, even on, on here. And uh, only the, the good, the good old ones managed to to survive to the lion. Golly, man! Thanks a lot. That's unbelievable hunt. That was great. 
You know, what really makes you feel good is every single part of these buffalo out here and everything else we've hunted is 100% utilized, and it's great. I mean, these people, there's no such thing as refrigeration in this country. That meat is utilized among the whole village, uh, the people that are working here in the camp. In, in a matter of a week, that buffalo will be completely consumed, and you feel really good about it because you've got a lot of protein to a lot of people that it's really important. Thank you. Oui, merci. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.